Hello everyone, welcome to Prep Work Steering. So today we have a very, very common region style problem on uh, the geometry regions. So this is just a quick question I pulled and it has to do with similarity and proportion. It's one of the most common topics on the region, so it's something you better study up on. But let's just go through this problem together and uh, solve it. All right, in the diagram below, BC connects points B and C on the congruent sides of isosceles triangle ADE such that triangle ABC is isosceles with vertex angle A. All right, so a couple things here. So we know that uh, angle ABC is congruent to angle ACB and uh, angle ADE is congruent to angle AED because base angles of isosceles triangles are congruent. And, uh, we also know that these uh, triangles share the same vertex angle. So we have a vertex angle of A here. So if you don't, ha if you haven't realized this already, this is uh this is AA similarity theorem. So since you know that both triangles share the same vertex angle and the other two angles are congruent, then they're similar. So we got that out of the way. We know these two triangles are similar. Now let's just prove uh what well what is the question here? Well, we know that we're giving a bunch of side lengths and we need to find what BC is. So let's just label the diagram. So AB is 10, 10, BD is 5, 5, DE is 12, and uh, we don't know what BC is. So we're just going to label that X. All right. So with these kinds of problems, what you need to do is recognize that you have two triangles. You have triangle ABC and you have triangle ADE. If they're similar, they have the same proportion. So the ratio of their side lengths are the same. So what you can do here is, oh, let's find AD. So what is AD? Well, 10 plus 5, 15. All right, 15 it is. So let's say we have 15 on one side. We can actually set up a cross multiplication problem. So 15, what is that congruent? Well, not congruent, similar to in terms of triangle ABC. So we know that this side of triangle ADE is 15. So what is the corresponding side on triangle ABC? Perfect, that's 10. Wow, so we set 10 here. We set this equal to our other known side length. So in this case, we know 12 on this side. So we know 12 is uh, up here. So now that we have these problems, what is the missing side length? Well, it is BC and it happens to have um, the x value. So we need this x value here because we're solving for x. And if we solve for x, that's what we get. We get bc. So I also forgot to include, but your uh, proportion has to include um, the missing length that you're trying to solve for. Otherwise, you're just solving for nothing. Although there are some ways you can solve backwards, but that's too complicated. We're not getting into that. So if you just call cross multiply here, we get 10 times 12. I hope you know that is 120 equals 15 times x, 15x. Now, if we just isolate the x, divide everything by 15, 120 divided by 15 is 8. So the answer is number 3. Yes, perfect.